Hey everybody, happy Monday again. It's another day to think about the ways in which God has given us the opportunity to reach out to a world that's in desperate need of Him and His love. Today, I'm going to introduce you in a moment to Sherry and to Lata, and they'll talk a little bit about this program that we put in place called Operation Christmas Cheer. So you might have heard about Operation Christmas Cheer. It's been on the bridge the last week or so. It came up fairly quickly during a COVID committee meeting. Lata and I and the group were talking about ways to be positive instead of just COVID restrictions. And we came up with the idea of spreading some Christmas cheer, of giving a package to every member in Woody Nook with the hopes that when they receive a package, they will pass it forward to someone in their community. So then I, I came up with the idea and Lotta took it and ran with it. So why don't you tell what's in the packages? Yeah. And so for families, we thought it would be fun to have kind of a night in because we can't do a whole lot of other things. So we've included some popcorn and some candy canes and then hopefully, you know, have a movie night or have a game night and have some fun and have some snacks. And then for those of us without young kids um, or young at heart, we thought a cup of coffee or tea with some stroke baffles uh, would be a nice way to listen to some carols, um, have a Zoom meeting with some family members whatever people want to feel connected and to, yeah, get a smile on their faces. So today's delivery day, we're so excited that we had 70 people sign up in short notice to make all the deliveries. We hope we'll get to everybody. Rural addresses are lots of fun. So we'll do our best to get everyone. If you get missed, give the church a call. It's not because we don't want to get to you. It's because you have a box number and we can't find it. So give the church office a call or send an email. If you still want to participate, we would love to have every member reach out to someone in their community, a neighbor, a friend, someone you've made contact with. Make up your own little Christmas cheer package and send it along to them. This is a year where we need to reach out and spread the good news of Jesus. So we encourage you to Participate in Operation Christmas Cheer. We hope it brings a little bit of Christmas cheer and we look forward to finding other ways of spreading cheer and goodwill in this coming year. It's awesome that so many of us have signed up to help out in this way, to, to share the good news and to reach into one another at this time. But it's also an opportunity then. So once you get your package, take that opportunity to then think about maybe three neighbors that you could give something to. And included in the package is actually a caroling sheet or an offering in which you can go around to your neighborhood and sing some carols. And I'd encourage you to do so. Uh, we were sitting on our front porch the other day and the, there was a parade, a, kind of an impromptu parade. Actually, I don't think it was impromptu. I had no idea it was coming though. And this fire truck showed up and then all of these golf carts and stuff from Gold Lake Village were driving around, decorated in Christmas uh, lights and other things. And it just, it made me a little bit happy. It was a way to spread some, some love and joy. And so I would encourage you to do the same. Go around your neighborhood and just sing. It doesn't matter if you're good or not. This way we get to enjoy and to spread some of the goodness that comes at Christmas time. So if you've enjoyed this video and if you've thought about some of the ways in which you can give, write down below on how you plan to share some good news this particular Christmas season.